you know, if you're going to convert one of these on your own, the best thing to do is start with a great manual. We got the Haynes Owner's Workshop Manual. It's a step by step process in here so you don't just start tearing things apart because um, we want to salvage as much as possible. So we're going to go step by step in the manual. It tells you exactly what to do. First thing we need to do is break these tires loose. Let's get at it. Next, we're going to take out the wheel well rivets. See around here, so we can get the wheel well out. All right, so we don't lose these rivets. We're going to pop these back in after we take them out. I'm going to disconnect the wires on the headlights and the uh, headlight washer fluid. It's got a little servo up here, so we need to disconnect all that and the hoses. Okay, now we need to take the hood insulation off so we can get to some of the wiring and uh, hoses underneath this. Some people call it a hood, some people call it a bonnet. We call it a hood here in America. Mini Cooper calls it a bonnet. Here we go. Ooh. All right. Let's go back that way with it. All right, now we're going to take the battery off the vehicle. Okay, this is the vehicle system computer. We're going to pull it out now. Pull these little clips on the end, and they slide right off the top. There we go. Don't need that anymore. Nope. So, so, here. there we go. There we go. We're about ready to take off the air filter here. We've just loosened all the bolts around it, taking the clamp off of the air hose, break them out. Yeah, this is something we definitely don't need in an electric car anymore. Uh, it's been a great day, got a lot accomplished, that's a wrap for the day.